good. We've got a plug foul in here. Hey, how's everybody doing today? Plan is go up, knock some rust off of me and Papa Fox tried here. It's been about six to eight weeks since we've been up. So a beautiful day, great weather. It's a good day to go fly. So let's go try this out. Clear. Traffic Turkey, South on Bravo, the far in the pattern, heading west, escrow traffic. Have a good flight, Steve. Thank you. Hey, we'll quit. All right, let's go ahead and run through a run up. Brakes are set, fuel is on. Ram is set for takeoff. Instruments are set. Primer is in and locked.
David Sioux County traffic says uh, 78144 is the party to pattern down to the south. David Sioux County. Well, this is no good. Got a f plug foul in here. Well, crap. Meow. Ah, oh, fudge. Uh, 200 drop. That is a no-go. Ashford traffic here, considering Lima's left base for three Ashford. Okay, well... I really hope to make a video today, but, uh, but as you see, we're having issues with a fouled plug. This is the reason we do these checks and uh, make sure that the plane is up to par for flying, and it looks like today is not. So I, I may have to pull the cowling and uh, pull and inspect our the plugs, perhaps even get them checked. Um, I know I've got four... Uh, Four out of the eight are new. I got to replace the other four, and I'm betting it's the uh, the second four that are giving me problems. So I guess we're going to taxi back to the hangar and uh, and call it a day. Uh, I hate it. I really wanted to go up today, but uh, yeah, safety first, right? So I'll make our call. We'll be taxiing back. Nashboro traffic, Cessna 594, Papa Fox Strauss going to be taxiing from the Compass Rose back to the open hangars. Nashboro. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Well, that's what I get for uh, letting her sit for about uh, six, eight weeks. Uh, the rust of flying does not just accumulate on the pilot. So, uh, now to avoid the fouling, you you really need to lean while on the ground, uh, lean the fuel air mixture, and now I do always lean, but that doesn't always eliminate the uh, possibility of it happening, so. Ashford traffic, check it three, Lima turn foul for three, Ashford. All right, so. Anyways, we're going to pack her back up into the hangar and come out another day, pull the cowling, check on those plugs, and uh, see where we go. We're going to sit here and do one more run-up test just to make sure, and uh, and then we'll we'll put her to bed. So we'll run her up to 15 or 1700 RPM. We are still very lean. That's why it's not running right. Uh, riching it all the way up. There's 17 set, and here's the first mag, 
with only maybe 25 RPM drop back to both. And we'll check the other mags. And this is where we get our stumble or losing almost 200 RPM. So that is definitely a no-go. Anywhere from 50, maybe even I'd accept up to 75 RPM drop, but you can hear the difference here. Well, maybe you can't. Anyway, so, yep, she's still failing that, so we're definitely gonna have to put her to bed and look at this another day. I was really hoping to fly today. We got a nice storm coming in tomorrow, or uh, early early hours of in the morning. So it's gonna be another another week until I can get up. So I know this was short and uh, uneventful, but uh, maybe somebody can take a lesson out of it. Get that mag drop out of tolerance. Don't go fly. So until next time, y'all fly good. Traffic three Bravo whiskey's down went for only three Ashra. Alright. Shut this thing down, screw the aircraft, verify ELT is silent, I never took off. Avionics coming off.